Are you ready for Jesus' return? What if I told you there are mind-blowing secrets about his return that you might not know? If you're prepared for Jesus' return, type Amen. If you're uncertain, type Lord, have mercy. Today, we uncover 10 mind-blowing secrets about Jesus' return that will leave you in awe and anticipation. Let's dive straight into it. Secret number one, the exact timing of Jesus' return is unknown. Matthew 24, 36 says, but about that day or hour, no one knows, not even the angels in heaven, nor the Son, but only the Father. This means we must always be prepared and live each day with purpose. Jesus emphasized the importance of vigilance and readiness, knowing that his return could happen at any moment. Number two, Jesus will return like a thief in the night. 1 Thessalonians 5-2 tells us, For you yourselves are fully aware that the day of the Lord will come, like a thief in the night. It will be sudden and unexpected, catching many off guard. His metaphor underscores the need for constant spiritual vigilance and preparedness. Secret number three, every eye will see him. Revelation 1-7 says, Behold, he is coming with clouds and every eye will see him. This event will be visible to all, transcending time zones and geographical location. There will be no denying or missing the grandeur of his return, uniting all of humanity in that moment. Number four, the sound of a trumpet will announce his arrival. First Thessalonians 4, Thessalonians 4, 16 reveals, For the Lord himself will descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trumpet of God. This powerful sound will herald the beginning of a new era. The trumpet signifies both a call to attention and the fulfillment of God's promise. Secret five, the resurrection of the dead. First Corinthians 15 to 52 tells us, for the trumpet will sound and the dead will be raised imperishable and we will be changed. Those who have died in Christ will rise and receive new glorified bodies. This resurrection is a testament to the power of Christ over death and a preview of the eternal life promised to believers. Number six, the gathering of believers. Matthew 24, 31 says, and he will send his angels with a loud trumpet call and they will gather his elect from the four winds from one end of the heavens to the other. Believers from all over the world will be united with Christ. This divine gathering underscores the inclusivity and reach of God's kingdom, bringing together his children from every corner of the earth. Secret seven. Jesus will appear in all his glory. Titus 2.13 speaks of the blessed hope, the appearing of the glory of our great God and Savior, Jesus Christ. This will be a magnificent and awe-inspiring sight. His return in glory will signify the ultimate victory over sin and death, bringing hope and joy to all who have awaited his coming. Number eight, the final judgment. Matthew 25, 31, 32 tells us, when the Son of Man comes in his glory, he will separate the people one from another as a shepherd separates the sheep from the goats. This will be a time of reckoning for all. It will be a moment of truth where each person's life and choices will be laid bare before the righteous judge. Secret 9. The creation of a new heaven and a new earth. Revelation 21 per 1 reveal. Then I saw a new heaven and a new earth for the first heaven and the first earth had passed away. This will be a place of eternal peace and joy. It symbolizes the renewal and perfection of creation free from the effects of sin and suffering. And finally, number 10, the eternal reign of Christ. Revelation 11 to 15 declares, the kingdom of the world has become the kingdom of our Lord and of his Messiah, and he will reign forever and ever. Jesus will rule with justice and love forever. His eternal reign will bring unending peace, righteousness, and fellowship with God. Their secrets are not just stories, they are promises of what's to come. Revelation 3.11 tells us, I am coming soon, hold on to what you have so that no one will take your crown. The secrets revealed in Revelation 3.11 about Jesus' return are truly mind-blowing. It's a testament to the eternal hope and promise we have as believers in Christ. Are you ready for Jesus' return? If you're prepared for Jesus' return, type Amen. If you're uncertain, type Lord, have mercy. With that said, please like, share, subscribe, and comment below. Thanks for watching, and until next time.